Good evening, YouTubes. Welcome back to another episode of Shop Talk with Brett. And last night's video went well. That carburetor worked real good, so I brought home another one. And this one is far worse. Lucky. Same kind of carburetor, Briggs & Stratton, six and a half horse quantum, primer type. She's a little funky. Ooh, and it also stinks. But look at that. That's pretty bad. There's our bowl. Or there's our carburetor. There's our bowl. There's our main jet. There's our float pin. And our float. And there's our needle. So you know the drill. We're going to get this stuff packed up. We're going to put it in here. This time, I've got the ultrasonic already prepped. So we'll be back when we go to start this up. Stay with us. Okay, we've got our stuff in the bath right now. We've got our small parts in the T. In the T-ball, we've got our float floating in there. The carburetor's in there. The bowl's in there. And we're at 50 degrees. Water temperature set at 60, and that does come up when the heat's on or when the ultrasonic is on. So I'm going to start it, give you a second, and then I'm going to and then I'm going to get away from it. That way, you guys are not subjected to the sound of uh, what sounds like an AM radio that's extremely out of tune. So here we go. <laughs> starting to see some progress. Let's cover it up and come back when this is elapsed. Okay, folks, that was after the first 15 minutes. And let's see what we got. There's the carburetor. And it did not darken it at all. That's a good thing. A lot of that muck is gone. Look down in here into the moor. Focus. And still got a little bit more to go. We'll look in the face of the carburetor here. It's looking pretty good. There's the carburetor. There's our bowl, which did come pretty good. Again, we'll, we're gonna run it another 15 minutes. There's our float pin. There's our needle. There's our float, which could go in again, like I said. And there's our main jet, which was pretty crusty before. It's coming clean. We're gonna do another round, see what she does. But I've got confidence I think this is going to work. So stay with us. Let's go for another clean. Okay, we're set up again in the uh, cleaner. Yeah, you see the water tonight got uh, darker than it did on last night's carburetor. But anyway, this time I bumped our heat up to 65. So let's go 15 minutes again. Well, we're at 30 now, so... That's too high. There's 15 minutes. Heat is on. We're at 60 degrees. Let's start it up. And we'll be back after the 15 minutes and see what we got. Okay, we are back, and after the second 15 minutes, we are complete. Let's look at the carburetor first. It did not darken it. That actually cleaned up pretty good. I took a scotch bright to that because there was still some gasket material stuck to it. But I blew everything out real good. We can look into the throat of the carburetor. That looks good. Everything looks good in there. 
Our throttle plate moves just fine. So that looks good. And here's our float. Float came out absolutely spotless. Here's that nasty bowl. Came pretty clean. Now this one was a painted one and the, the paint stayed on it this time on the outside, but uh, that all the varnish and everything is gone out of the bowl. Here's our main jet, which came out absolutely phenomenal. Look at that. That came out pretty good. We'll blow that out with some air just to be sure. There's our needle. Clean. And our float pin right there. Perfect. Okay, folks. Well, going to blow this out real quick with some air just to be sure. I'm going to reassemble it. And uh, hopefully we'll have two for two. Um, I'm going to back that off a little bit. Yeah, we had a good result there tonight. Well, the carburetor we did last night turned out absolutely good. That machine fired right up. And uh, when I take this down to work Monday and put it back on the machine that this goes on, we'll see what this does. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Most importantly, put your trust in the Lord. We'll talk on the next video. Shop Talk with Brett signing out.